Hey guys, Chase Sick here. Today we are going to do some AT&T QCI testing. So, on the far right side of your screen, I have an iPhone 16 Pro Max on AT&T Business Unlimited Premium. In the middle of your screen is an AT&T Turbo Line, which is QCI 7. And at the way end there, I have a Google Pixel 9 Pro XL. That is on QCI 8 and is on AT&T Unlimited Premium without the turbo add-on. Okay, here we go. Well, let's run all these individually once. Just to see kind of what we're getting here. I do not have the greatest AT&T service in my house. It's actually very poor. Um, so we're not going to see any crazy speeds. This tower is actually backhaul capped at like 100 megabit. So it's very slow. So this is actually a good showing of what the QCI will actually do. And I know these phones do have different modems, um, so it's not going to be a perfect compar comparison, but whatever. Okay, so the iPhone 16 is done on um, AT&T Business Unlimited Premium, just so you, I mean, can't really show you, it just says AT&T. 24.2 down, 0.27 up. Okay, that's interesting. The AT&T Turbo Line is at 56.3 down. Why does that one have such a better signal? What? Anyway, okay, well, we're gonna keep going because they're all set up the same. All right, so 56.3 down, 2.18 up on the QCI7 AT&T Turbo Line. Now let's run the QCI, just I'll show you that this is just not AT&T Turbo, just as AT&T. It is QCI8, which is still a priority on at and but not, you know, seven or six. Six is first net and or business unlimited premium for certain things. <clears throat> like YouTube, for example, on business unlimited premium does not go at QCI6, it goes at QCI7. So only certain things are QCI6 on business premium, but you could just use a VPN and then everything is QCI6. So there's that too. Okay, it looks like that one got 51.7 down, 2.93 up. Now, here's the fun part. We're going to run all these at the same time. Uh, this will be kind of hard to do. I'm going to start the iPhones first because they take longer to actually start. Um, Uh-oh. Oh, well, here we go. We're all to the same server. Oh, now, okay. I think the business premium had a little fluke on its test on the first round. So, Turbo Line is struggling to start. And I've noticed this, that the turbo line seems to be the sluggish, which is weird because you wouldn't think that. You'd think if it was turbo, it had some kind of, you know, has some kind of priority boost. And it does. It just doesn't seem to make a difference. And you definitely can see the QCI 6 versus 8 difference there. It's, oh, it's more than double the speed on QCI 6. So let's try that again. Okay. See if I'll actually start this time. I did have this work once. Okay, there we go. So QCI 6 is like, I'm going to take priority. Thank you very much. Um, QCI 8's been pretty good. On the Pixel. 22 down on the Turbo Line. Better than the Turbo Line. So QCI 6 did win again. That is to be expected. Turbo is in last place again. Damn, I'm going to remove Turbo from my line. That's my main line, by the way, on that iPhone SE. That's my main, like, phone numbered line. And I feel like it's just awful performance. Yes, I use AT&T, okay? They have the best coverage. <laughs> Even if they're slow as crap. Okay, we'll run one more. Three, two, one, yoink. Two. Okay. I'll run it again. Pings are identical on the iPhones. A little higher on the Pixel. The Pixel always has higher pings for the version. Turbo's losing again. And QCI 6 is with it again, which makes sense. Yeah, so honestly, Turbo add on might not really be that useful um, for my testing. Although, business always loses on the upload for some reason. I, I don't know why, but it just does. Uh, let me actually move that phone to kind of. 
slightly more or less by the window and see if that helps. Okay. I, I move the business line so it's not immediately like, I feel like it's just being blocked. Anyway, okay. Three, two, one, go, go, go. Now let's see how we do. We went up a bar. The iPhone 16s have the worst cellular, by the way. They're awful. Truly atrocious. Oh my God, the triple line is like dead. Two download? Why is QC8 doing so much better? Like what? There's nothing terrible about that AT&T. What is terrible about that? That is slow. Three download? What year is it? 2005? What? Okay, I want to run. Now we're going to run just... Okay. Let's run just the turbo line and the QCA6 line. So, seven and six. Let's run just these and see what happens. Lower ping on the business line. That's normal. The business normally gets lower ping for some reason. Oh, yeah. It's definitely taking priority there. Holy... Yep, QCI 6 is just like, yep, I'm gonna take that bandwidth. Thank you very much. Oh, my, sorry, my pixel went to sleep. Hope that doesn't mess up the recording. Okay, yeah, that's fascinating. So 12.9 down on the, mainly gonna focus on download because I don't think there actually is any priority on upload. Um, so 12.9 down on QCI 7, 58.9 on QCI 6. Let's run QC8 and QC7 and see what we get here. Uh, I do notice the QC8 and 7 phones are on 5G and the business line is on LTE. That may make a subtle difference. Wow, it's looking to me that Turbo is a complete ripoff because the QC8 line is beating it. And now that could be a modem difference. Uh, but you'd think it would at least be a little faster. But if I ran the business line, it would just kill them. Okay. So 38.3 down on QCI 7, 39.9 on QCI 8. Let's try QCI 8 and QCI 6. I always start the iPhones a little sooner because the, the Android app restarts faster than the iPhone, than the iOS phone does. Oh yeah, I just like obliterated almost. Oh, what? What is happening? What? Okay, there we go. I was like, what? Huh, so turbo sucks. That's what I'm gathering from this. I don't know, if, if you guys have experience with AT&T Turbo, let me know in the comments, because right now it's not looking very good. Anyway, 41 down on QCI 6 and 33.5 on QCI 8. And let's go one more time for all of them. Run the iPhones first, then run the Pixel. Okay, let's have some fun. Here we go. Business got lower ping again. That is normal. Mm, yeah, it seems like they're all running that Turbo is like... Wow, Turbo's like QCI 9 or something. <laughs> It's not, but it looks like it. So business one again, 44.5 down, which is to be expected is the highest priority. Oh yeah, the lower the number, the higher priority. Should have said that earlier in the video. But also if you're watching this nerdy network QCI value stuff, you probably already know that. Um, anyway. Thank you guys for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. More AT&T testing to come. Uh, my Verizon site is now multi-gig, so I'll be doing some testing there too. But anyway, yeah, peace out.